All right, if your iPhone has but automatically disconnect or turns off, let me show you what you have to do to get a fix. But I gotta say that this issue is very, very popular on any iPhone model. So don't be surprised if this happens to you again. All right, let's go. Let's start off opening the control center and make sure the low power mode is off when you're gonna use the Haspa. That's because low power mode really affect any wireless connection on your iPhone, including Wi-Fi, Signal, Bluetooth, and Haspa. The automatic disconnection also happens when the iPhone screen is locked. And I have one solution for that. When the iPhone screen is locked, ask C to turn on the haspa hey, and it's see, like magically the, the haspa has will remain on until you turn it off manually it really works it's like a trick just try that if siri doesn't respond on your iphone when the screen is locked let me show you why open up the settings scroll down let's go ahead and tap on siri right there and make sure that setting is on allow siri when locked another solution is turn off the wi-fi bluetooth connection and force restart your iphone to do that you're gonna press and release volume up press and release volume down then press and hold down the power button until the iphone turn off keep holding down the power button until the iphone turn off just like that once you see the apple logo release the power button so you will be good to go just wait until the iphone turn on unlock your iphone go to settings turn on the haspa and try to connect any device to your iphone to see if now the problem is gone if you still guys in problem I have the last solution that I'm sure that will fix any wireless issue including Haspa. Let me show you. For that you're gonna open up the settings. Let's go ahead and tap on general. Scroll the way down until you see this setting, transfer or reset iPhone. Here, let's go ahead and tap on reset. We have different options right here. Make sure you select the second one, reset network settings, okay? You're gonna type in the screen password, but before you do that, let me explain something to you. When you reset the network settings, that will factory reset all the wireless connection, including Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, Signal everything in Haspa too. The downside is that you will have to reconnect your iPhone to your Wi-Fi network. And also you will have to reconnect all the Bluetooth accessories that you had connected to your iPhone, you know what I mean? But the thing is, this is the only solution to fix any wireless connection issue on any iPhone. So you will have to do that no matter what. If you are good to go, type in the screen password. You will see a few process on the screen. Just let it finish. And after unlock your iPhone, connect your iPhone to your Wi-Fi network, go ahead and connect all the Bluetooth accessory to your iPhone, and then try your Haspa connection. I hope this video helped you out. If you got any question, please let me know in the comment section, drop a like, subscribe to the channel. I will see you in my next video. Bye.